Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. So this video is going to be a vacation prep. So you're gonna come with me as I get my hair done. Um, you know, personally prep for my trip and pack with me for my trip. So I'm going to, should I tell y'all? Maybe I shouldn't tell y'all. I think I'm gonna wait to the, until the actual vlog so you guys can see where I'm going. But I'm going out of town again to work. I leave this weekend. I leave Sunday, today is Tuesday. So, since I'm working, I have to pack my hair supplies and stuff like that. And I know, I don't know if I have any hairstylists who view my videos, but I feel like this would be helpful because it's kind of a struggle to pack all my products and tools and everything when I'm going out of town. So today I have a hair appointment at 10.30. And I'm getting some braids, some knotless braids, but I'm getting them in a color that I had like two years ago and I'm running that back so I think it's gonna be cute on me again I haven't had it in a while and then your girl has been lash lashless for like two months so I do get these lashes done tomorrow and I'm so excited because I literally gave my lashes a break I have like a lot of lashes I have a lot of lashes already like naturally but let me zoom back but I just need my lashes done again like I look hold on don't get it twisted cuz I still look good without them but I just look better with them. so yeah I'm about to go So I'm just making it back home for getting my hair done. This is the color reveal. I got blonde braids. I had these two years ago, like I said earlier, and I just wanted to run them back. And they're cute. I just feel like I'll look even better when I have my lashes done because it won't look so like out there. But I really do like the color against my skin tone. It's three o'clock in the morning, y'all, by the way. I literally got home at like 1.30. I was getting my hair done all day. I'm so tired and I got clients early in the morning. So, yeah, I'm going to hit. Well, I got a client in the morning and then I get my lashes done after that. So, yeah, that's it for right now. I'm about to go to bed and catch back up, y'all, when I'm getting my lashes done tomorrow or today in like a couple hours. Hey, y'all, so I just made it back home. And I just got my lashes done earlier and they look... <laughs> they look good um every time i get my lashes done again from like taking a break i'd be like trying to get used to it they'd be looking too much on me for like the first day then after that i'd be like okay yeah like they're super cute they're not ugly now i just have to get used to them again but i get 16 through what do i get i get 14 through 16 or do i get 12 Maybe I should have my facts. Okay, I think I get 12, 14, 16s. I usually go for a cat eye, so short. A cat eye, so shorter in the middle. I mean, shorter in the corner, longer in the ends. And then sometimes I might do 18. That's my longest, but I did 16s this time just because I don't like my lashes take over my full face. But yeah, um, this is not part of the vlog, but today's my mom's birthday, so I am taking her out to dinner later on. And then i thought i'd leave sunday but really i'll leave monday so i mean i have more time to just prepare i mean there's nothing really left for me to do except pack my stuff like i said that is the main important thing like me me showing you guys how i pack my hair supplies but i did want to show you guys something because i ordered this shirt to go with this skirt that i've been having sit in my closet and i never wore before i don't be buying clothes and, and shoes and stuff but when I have somewhere to go, I will. But I've been telling myself I need to just buy clothes and shoes that I are, so I already have it in my house. I don't need to be buying stuff every time I have somewhere to go, because I'd be spending more money going to get an outfit like in store than me just ordering a whole bunch of stuff online and then me already having it in my closet. So yeah, I'm really gonna do like a big ass haul, like spend, spend, yeah, spend a man's for real, like on some stuff, because I need, I just need more stuff but i'm about to show you guys 
Oh. Put this packaging. I hope this color goes. I hope this goes with the skirt. I mean, even if it doesn't, I don't be trying to be too matchy matchy with like the color of greens that I do. Why did give me the shirt inside out? <laughs> That's weird. Why would they give me this shirt inside out? That is so ghetto. Like, that's so ghetto. It's cold in Georgia, y'all. The temperature just literally just dropped yesterday. Like, it literally said it was supposed to be colder than New York yesterday in Atlanta, which is crazy. So, I literally wore some Uggs today. But in Houston, I've been checking the weather, and it's literally still been, like, 72, 74. Houston still be hot. So, my thing is, like, it's fall time. It's about to be winter time. It's like, do I dress for the season because that's what you're supposed to do or for the weather outside because if it's up to me i'm gonna keep wearing some shorts and some boots like <laughs> if it's up to me but nah um yeah that's that's it that's all i got for y'all i am home from a lovely long day at work First client canceled on me this morning. Then I had another client. Then I decided to go, ooh. I decided to go shopping to pick up some pieces. Retail therapy. Then I had another client. And now I'm home, seven o'clock. I'm gonna show you guys what I got. I went to, Aritzia first, really because I just needed some basic teas. Mm, excuse me. Um, I was gonna order a whole bunch of just like basic teas off Skims, but I didn't, and I need them like ASAP. So I ended up just going to Aritzia. And first off, that was my first time in the Aritzia store at Linux, and it was so cute and inside. Like it was so cute. And nobody told me their items was that expensive. <laughs> like, nobody told me that. So, literally, I just really just got a black tea and a white tea. The quality is amazing. Now, it's not like a... I don't know. I don't know. I don't know how to explain the material because... I don't know, but they're actually really good qualities. Each one was $30. And the Skins one is like 48 but they're the same quality or they don't feel like the same material but the quality of it feels the same as the skims one so i definitely needed those i got this um sleeveless bomber thing it's sprayed at the ends over here then i got these black leather pants can you see them? Yeah, but they wide at the bottom. Well, they're not wide, but they're straight at the bottom and they have a slit in the inside. Then I got these pants. These pants. Again, they have a slit in the front. I do think I want to get this slit closed though, just because it will look better if I close the slit some light. So like right here. So, yeah, I got these in a extra small because they didn't have any other sizes available, but I, it's very stretchy and it looks so good on. I should try all these clothes on for y'all, but I don't want to. Y'all just go have to see them in outfits on my Instagram. Next, I got this cropped brown fur sweater so y'all can see the material. More leather. This leather skirt, but the leather skirt is a midi skirt and has a slit on the side so it has like this detail with a slit then lastly i got some jeans y'all i love a good pair of zara jeans like the majority of my jeans in my closet are from zara but they're just super long they fit tight they're not like a um boyfriend type of jean off i want to say they're like mom jeans but the bottom is a little flare just a tab it and then it has a slit inside 
But these are so cute. I think I'm gonna take these on the trip. Yeah, I'm gonna have to go to my mail room and pick up those packages. And then, hey Blue, hey TT man. Come here. Hey TT man. Blue, come here. Yeah. Hey baby boy. Hey TT man. Hey Blue man. I'm about to go pick up the packages out there. Literally, look how my spot looks. Like, I'm literally trying on clothes, just trying to figure out, like, look how, look, look, it's always like this. I done got stressed out because I done tried on the outfits that I ordered to burn on the trip, and I just really don't even like none of them. Like, it's good pieces. I just don't like how they look together <sighs> hey y'all it is saturday the next day right yeah so it's saturday the next day i woke up this morning and finally cleaned my closet i put a whole bunch of clothes away um i put a whole bunch of clothes away now it is one o'clock i'm about to return some packages so return this i got a vase to return um then i gotta take two items back from zara then i have to get two pair of pants that i showed you guys yesterday altered so i'm going to this place that does same day alterations because i leave monday and i want to wear those two pair of pants so yeah and then i'm getting my nails done literally y'all my nails have grown let me see if it can focus um, it's not focusing, but literally my nails are at the tip. And once my nails reach the tip of the actual fake part of the nail, I get my nails done like a whole new set because I hate how it looks with my natural nail, like my natural nail showing underneath. But, oh shoot. Yeah, I'm gonna take my camera with me, especially for when I go to nails on the vlog in there. I gotta go to the mall, so I'm probably not gonna vlog inside the mall because there'd be so much going on in there. And I'm going to Linux, so I'm definitely not vlogging, but yeah, we finna head out. Mm, Y'all, I'm literally so agitated. Like, you know when you be ripping and running? Why is it not focusing? Why is it not focusing on me? You know when you be ripping and running all day and your head just be spinning? That's me right now. Like, in between returning all this stuff, try, getting these clothes altered. First up, I struggled to even find the alteration place for like 30 minutes. And I go there all the time. And I always struggle to find where it's at. Then, I'm trying to figure out why the lighting is off. Okay. Then, I don't even know. I don't even know why this took me three hours to do. Like, I'm just aggravated and I can't pinpoint what it is. I think I'm aggravated because I know I have so much to do and I don't really have, today's my off day and I don't even feel like I'm off. Like I haven't even been able to sit and relax and I'm supposed to be off tomorrow, but I won't get to enjoy being off tomorrow because I still got to work. Then I still got YouTube videos to edit, so I think the fact that I know I'm behind on editing some YouTube videos, it's like, so much to do and not enough time. I know you're like, how am I not, how am I driving and my hands look free? Yeah, I drive with my knees. <laughs> the secret's out. I drive with my knees, like literally. It's a, I heard only bad bitches can do that. <laughs> ah, I'm aggravated I'm so aggravated Cause I just wanna go home And wake up And all of this Rushing Be over All of my problems Everything just be solved Yeah but I'm about to go get me a Chick -fil Some Chick-fil-A um, I'm about to go get me a chicken wrap and eat in the car <laughs> and just hope 
and hope that after I eat, I feel better. Because I think that's what it is. I think I'm just hungry too. So yeah. Like literally, I don't even know, bruh. I don't even know. Like, I don't know if tired is the word. I don't know if. Let me just drink something. It's like I want to say I'm about to be dramatic. But I'm not being dramatic. I'm I'm seriously annoyed. Like, I just want to go to sleep. I just want to go to bed. I just want to wake up. I don't want to wake up. I don't want to wake up. I don't want to. I don't want to see the sun. I don't want. I just want to go to bed. I want to go to sleep. I don't want to see nothing. I'm so tired, bro. I'm so tired. I'm not even packed. It's 10 o'clock right now. <laughs> That's not like I'm about to cry. It's literally 10 o'clock right now. I'm not even packed. My hair supplies are not packed. My flight, I gotta meet everybody at 5 a.m. And it's 10 o'clock. And I'm just aggravated because I'm so tired. I literally, I'm just so tired. I was supposed to be off today, but I wasn't off today. I had clients and I had to color a whole bunch of wigs. And it's not even the fact that, it's not even the fact that I had to it's not even in fact I had to color a whole bunch of wigs because that's for the trip that I'm going on. It's just the fact that like I'm literally, I was supposed to be off today and I didn't, I wasn't off. Like, you know what I mean? I wasn't off. Like I didn't get to really rest at all. I didn't get to relax. I was off yesterday, but I was ripping and running all day yesterday. Then I didn't get home till four o'clock this morning because I went to um, the freak meet party in ATL for 21 Savage's birthday. So I got home at four. I can't even get the suitcase open. Did a whole bunch of clients. Did get some clients and colored a whole bunch of wigs. And now it's 10 o'clock. I still got to drop my dog off to my sister's house and it's 10 o'clock. Like I still got to drop him off and drive, drop him off. up i'm gonna be tired but i'm not gonna be as agitated but it's just like damn i just hate i just hate when i hate when i'm last minute on everything and i wasn't even last minute because really i ordered my outfits ahead of time i ordered i pre-planned i didn't like none of the stuff that i ordered and this week was already just hectic period but it's always hectic before trips like what's up with that why is it like that like, is my time management really that bad? I'm gonna just bring these two right here. Cause this is technically my check bag. And, uh, I mean, what? That's technically a carry on. And that's too small for all my supplies anyways. So, this is gonna be my bag for my hair tools. And this bigger one is gonna have my clothes not all the honestly I think it's gonna fit, but should I do my hair stuff first? That hair stuff's gonna be easy. I really just need to do my clothes first. I'm gonna pack my pajamas and stuff like that. Never go wrong with skims. Um just skims i always just pack my skims outfits when i'm traveling like to wear to sleep or lounge around in because that's what it's for you know that's what it that's what it is it's loungewear did the beat go off dun, dun, dun. Didn't that song's always in my head i always pack sweatpants just these be my favorites Okay, I think that's enough, cause I'm, 
<laughs> I'm tripping now. Am I tripping? No, I don't think so. Okay, so I'm about to go ahead and close this up because I'm gonna come back in the suitcase in the morning, but that's to put my toiletries in there. So this is done. The other one is somewhere in my closet, and then I'm gonna just carry this bag because I have to have, I like to just carry bigger bags. That strap goes with that. But um, I need to transfer all my stuff. See, I be having bags everywhere. I need to transfer all my stuff into that over there, that bag over there. And, oh, I do need to put my laptop inside that suitcase, but I'm going to just leave my laptop. My dog follows me everywhere. His footsteps genuinely bother me because you follow me everywhere, everywhere. Like I'm going somewhere. I am, but you follow me like I'm about to disappear in another room in the house. Like, relax. Honestly? Honestly. Relax. Sit. Sit. You're embarrassing me. Sit. 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 He was embarrassing me. Because <laughs> why you not listening? Okay, um. He's still sitting. Yeah, stay. Stay. Don't follow me. Okay, um. Do I need anything else out in this closet before I leave? Because I'm, I'm about to close my door for good in this closet and I'm not going to come back. Watch him peek his head. See? Bruh, this man is funny. Like, <laughs> I should clean my makeup brushes before I go, shouldn't I? I don't feel like it. <laughs> That's the smart thing to do, but I feel like if I had time. Fuck, I just broke my Fenty thing. Okay, I'm not about to I'm not about to do this. I'm not about to play with it like this. This is what I bring for my toiletries. I got it off Amazon. Yeah, okay, huh? Back to this. I'm not washing my makeup brushes. I'm doing it when I get down here because I just don't feel like it. I just don't. And that's okay. This is my makeup container. Oh shit. Pull it all beautiful makeup so I bring my foundation Morphe palette powder I usually pack in the order that I put my makeup in but we already dysfunctional all right so we're gonna go ahead and skip that primer contour two different type of contours brow gel Beauty blender, face powder, sharpener. I want my tinted moisturizer. Another concealer. Facial products. And I'm putting all this again in here, but I'm taking it out as I use it later on today. Toothbrush, deodorant, serum. 
Girl, Night Gel, Oil, Lip, Moisturizer thing, Thingy. I have to pack floss. Like, oh, but I have a pack of it, I think. Yeah. 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 If y'all don't floss, I'm scared of you. <laughs> like, I just can't stand stuff being in my teeth. That bothers me so bad. So if you really don't floss, I'm really scared of you. Genuinely, stay with me. Mouthwash. This is not gonna fit in here. Yes, it will. Glycolic acid. Okay, so I took a break. <laughs> I took a break. Yep. Hmm. I'm gonna put all my products inside of this bag so it doesn't spill everywhere. But I'm still gonna bring this because I like to hold my products inside of this. So I'm gonna just put. I'm just take a clip and clip it just like that. Then all of these tools. I don't really have nothing fancy for this to go. I need to have a travel kit for my actual tools. Like I really need to come harder than how I'm coming. I'm about to put this in a Ziploc bag though because this is gonna spill it where be a little ghetto. Uh -huh. This just might be a little ghetto. Y'all was probably expecting something professional, huh? Well. Y'all was wrong. And just like that, you feel me? And on this side, I have all my hair tools. This is from my phone, this is a phone stand. We got all the wigs that I colored today and these wigs are not, um, they're not gonna stay in the suitcase. I'm just putting them in here for now. But I'm gonna take it out and give it to my client. This wig needs to air dry, so I'm probably going to keep this wig out because it still needs to air dry. All right, this is what the inside of my bag is looking like right now. I got my crimpers, curling irons, fly irons, hot comb, mini curlers, blow dryer. I got my different barrel sizes. You guys see me pack this up, so I just added some paper towels in a plastic bag just in case. You never know, especially because I always keep wipes with me, but I don't have any wipes with me this time. All right, so all my stuff is over there. Yeah, it's gonna get put in my bag in the morning. But, thanks for watching this hectic, hectic video. I'm gonna go ahead and hop in a shower and then I'm gonna drop my dog off and then I'm going to sleep. Let's hope I make this flight in the morning and we'll find out in the next vlog if I do. <laughs> <laughs>